Hello. Today is Thursday, June 27th, 2019. This is your daily for today. The first card uh, that I pulled is the Eight of Wands. And the Eight of Wands can be a lot of different things for me. For me, for my channel, for my messages. So I'm going to start out with the Eight of Wands being a lot of people having a lot of paperwork, a lot of things to be detailed, um, a lot of things to go over, something being um, very uh, important but yet complicated, something that you have to reverse or rehearse, something that you're <clears throat> going to have to go over and over. It could be, if you're an actress, it could be that you're, you're learning all these lines. You're having so many things to learn. If you're um, in the accounting department, if you work with numbers all the time, then this could be that you have several different uh, areas to compare to to find out maybe the difference, um, maybe to find out what's the credit and what's the debit. I don't know. Um, but I'm also feeling like this is, as far as love is concerned, this is somebody who's coming in and out of your life all the time. Somebody, um, and again, this is for air signs, sorry. Somebody who's coming in and out of your life all the time. Somebody who's not creating stability for you. Somebody who's not not sure what to do. Somebody who's not taking the advantage of having this wonderful relationship um, and they're not communicating. So it's also telling me with this Eight of Wands that uh, communication is not going back and forth. It is not between two people. It is only one-sided. And it feels like everybody's wanting a change in something, but yet no one is attempting the task or completing the task to start to communicate to one another, to express your feelings, your concerns, um, even things that you don't like, things that you do like, uh, even to make plans. It feels like, you know, it's very difficult to even set something up to get to be with somebody, to, to try to arrange to meet someone because there's no communication between the two of you. So, <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> The first card that I got today for air signs is definitely the Eight of Wands. And again, it also could be traveling. You may be doing a lot of traveling today. You may be going back and forth for work in a certain manner. You may be having to deliver. Maybe you're a delivery person. Um, also, too, though, it feels like somebody might be going back and forth on a decision that they have made. Maybe at one point you're saying, yeah, okay, and then the next point you're saying, no, you know what, I don't think I want to. And that doesn't have to be a relationship. That can be anything. So it's showing me that air signs today are having a little bit of trouble trying to get stable with a certain decision or um, a certain direction even. Okay, so that's air signs. Fire signs. Fire signs, fire signs. It Something feels really strong around, um, I want to say the judgment card. And, and I do have... Here with the judgment card, this is saying, um, and by the way, this deck is a compliment from Tyler's Tarot. Just thought I'd let you know. So, again, here being, um, it feels really, this feels really strong. This feels almost as if there's a celebration for some of you fire signs in one aspect of your life. In one particular area. Not in all areas, okay? But I am getting that there are three here. Some of you are with someone and have a child with them. Some of you um, may be even single, but still have a child with somebody. For some of you. For some of you, this is showing that, you know, the universe and the angels are trying to bless that union. Trying to get you all back together so that you can all raise your child together. So that this can be one big happy family. That's what the universe is trying to create for you. For some of you, you feel a lot of distance between you and maybe your child's father or your child's mother. But it does feel like there's just someone's being stubborn. Somebody's not wanting to... Um, agree to disagree, and so to speak, but but trying not to. Somebody's just not wanting to give in. It's it's like almost like you're, um, or there, whoever. Their ego is so big that it's like I can't admit that I was wrong. I just have to stick to this and and keep it this way. So whoever that is needs to humble themselves. Somebody needs to humble themselves with fire signs. Okay, or maybe it's a fire sign that needs to humble themselves, whichever way that works for you. <coughs> I also feel that there's um, 
an invitation or there's a um, offer that is coming. And it could be something from a family member. It could be something also from a job. Um, this offer or invitation could be offering you an advancement, offering you a new title, a new position, a new job. Um, this could be definitely money coming up. Um, I do see finances increasing for fire signs. That message is coming in. I'm also feeling like with fire signs, um, you guys have fought this battle or a battle for quite some time. And I feel like for a while you thought maybe things weren't going to change around or turn around. But I think now, like as of today, you're starting to see changes there. I think you're starting to understand and realize that uh, things aren't quite what they seem. They are getting better. There might be oh, there might be some work to have to do to get it to the next level, but I think you'll do it. Fire signs, you feel very positive to me, and I feel like any challenges that come towards you, you will be able to overcome. You will be able to overcome. So, fire signs, it looks like a good day for you. It really does. Water signs, water signs. <clears throat> some of you may be feeling like the hermit, may be feeling like you're left out, may be feeling like somebody's not including you. Um, may feel like you're the only one who wants to do certain things or you're the only one who um, has the best interest of a situation at heart or you may feel like you're the only one who's trying or you may feel like you're the only one who cares in a certain relationship, in a situation. But be careful because I do feel like with water signs that it, it you're just not seeing the other person's side. Because somebody doesn't act like you or show their emotions the same way you do, that doesn't mean that they don't care or it doesn't mean that they're not sad. <clears throat> it's just like when you're having a loss of a family member or a loved one and everybody grieves on a different pace. Well, everybody expresses their emotions on a different level too. Not everybody is all lovey-dovey. Not everybody is going to come out and just say, I love you so much, you mean the world to me. But a lot of people, which I think is great, will show their feelings. They will give you the action that you need to see. And sometimes the action is better than hearing because sometimes people can say anything, but they can't do anything or they can't show you anything. So that, that can be sometimes a cause for concern. So I feel like water signs, somebody is, is definitely going to be able to give action, either that's you or your partner. But I feel like if you can't show it uh, or say it, I'm sorry, you're going to show it. So water signs feels like you have uh, a lot going on where there could be um, there definitely could be I'm gonna I want to say that a breakup for some not many but there could be a breakup for some for some of you it could actually be the reserve the reversed someone could be coming back to you so water signs if you are interested you will have the opportunity to make a decision about a partner from the past. That feels very strong. For some of you, it feels like there's going to be um, an upheaval of some sort. So if you don't break up, there may be some type of argument coming today. So if you want to prevent that argument, try to just stay open-minded, try to stay focused, uh, try to agree to disagree to a certain situation, or just say nothing. Because someone may want you to feed into something because they want an argument to start, because they want to back up from you, because they want a break. So if you don't give them that break, then they can't get it, okay? So that's what I hear for water signs. All right, so now I have the nine of swords for earth signs. Earth signs, the nine of swords, you know, you, you woke up this morning feeling like, oh, God. It's only Thursday, one more day, one more day. And you're telling yourself, I got one more day until I'm finished. And then I can have freedom for the weekend. A lot of you are definitely focused on getting through this work week. A lot of you feel overwhelmed and stressed out about a situation. Some may be about your job. Some may be about a relationship or family life. But some of you definitely are feeling overwhelmed. And you're saying to yourself, uh, just like this card. You look just like this card this morning. When that alarm clock went off, that's exactly what you looked like. Absolutely. Um, it's also saying that earth signs have some chores or things that need to get done after work. Be careful because a friend is going to ask you for a favor today as well. So you're going to have to try to fit that in too. And you're going to be like, you know what? I'm just done. I'm just done. It's not that you don't want to help that friend, but I feel like you've been pushed to your limit for the week, earth signs. But it's okay because I feel like it's going to balance itself out. Things are going to definitely go in a good direction. So there's not going to be much to worry about there. I also feel like with fire signs, um, 
Once you get your day started, it's not going to be that bad. It's really not. And um, I do feel like some a lot of you are eating pizza for lunch. I don't know who's doing that. I just heard that. Man, I wished I was. Um, but a lot of you are eating pizza for lunch. I also feel like there's um, a lot of fire signs who are going a distance away. Um, and Okay, so now I'm reading into Friday. But going a distance away for this weekend coming because I feel the travel being set up. So maybe you're setting it up today. Maybe you're making the arrangements today. Maybe you're telling someone that you're coming today their way. Um, Fireside, you guys feel like you've been worrying a lot about something. Um, but you know what? Worrying won't change whatever the situation is. Faith will, prayer will, and that's it. So to worry will not resolve the issue, will not change it. It will not make something better. It will not make something worse. Um, but worrying will just make you sick. So whoever's doing all that worrying, let's not do it. All right. And today's card in general, guess who it is? Yes, sir. So... <clears throat> this is a warning of being careful of toxic people today, being careful of toxic things, be careful of overdoing something. If you're going to happy hour after work, don't overdo it. If you do overdo it, make sure you get an Uber or a Lyft or whatever and get a ride home. Do not try to drive and think you can. It's not worth five and ten thousand dollars worth of fines, legal fees, loss of license, DUIs, DWIs, whatever. It's not worth it. So be careful. Today is a day. Also, this devil could symbolize um, uh, addiction. So uh, let's be careful of relapsing today. Let's right now take a, a time to uh, say your serenity prayer, to call your sponsor, to do what it is that you need to do in order to strengthen your recovery, okay? Because um, I don't want you to feel weak today because it's one day, one minute at a time, one hour at a time, whatever works for you. But get your support system set up and use them because that's what helps, right? All right, so for others of you, this could be somebody lying to you today. So be be careful. If somebody's coming to you with a bullshit story and you feel like it's bullshit, trust your intuition. Because if it, does, if it doesn't make sense, if two and two is not giving you four, then you know something's wrong here. Okay? So, for the most part, have a great, great day today. Uh, again, it is Thursday. One more day till Friday for those of you in the work week. And I look forward to seeing you tomorrow morning.